Hi. Hello. I'm using the electro stim pack. Or what it's meant to. Or what it's actually meant to do. Helping you lose Not give him labor pains, but to help with a, an inflamed spastic muscle in his neck. My left trap. Left trap. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Two. Two. Dos. Dos. Two days to go. We can figure out Adam Costello. That's a cute little two. It's a cute little two. I'm not going to put that big seven little, little two. two. I'm going to put that little two right, right. there. <laughs> Isn't that a cute little two? Um, two days ago, we saw the doctor today for our... Two days ago? Two days to go. It's like two days ago. What? What happened two days ago? No, two days to go to due dates. Yes. We saw the doctor today for, I guess, the 40-week uh, appointment coming 40 on Saturday. And things are progressing. Um, yesterday, I don't know if we mentioned it or not. I think I did. I had like six and a half hours straight of kind of every 10 to 15 minutes I was feeling something. And then it all just stopped. Uh, but that is common for first baby. I'm basically following my mom's exact pattern with what she did with, with Ivan, where it kind of starts and then it stops. And then it kind of starts and it stops. But things are doing what it's supposed to do. And... Uh, I am, I am slightly dilated, about a centimeter and a half, and uh, she stripped my membranes. That's an interesting, very, very interesting feeling. Um, we didn't say it on the thing yesterday just because it's a yucky word, but do you want to say it? My least favorite word? Uh-huh. The mucus plug! Lost the mucus plug yesterday morning, and then like a whole nother bit, bit today. So, I mean, we're definitely heading in the right direction so the doctor as well as the nurse and three other friends kept saying go to this restaurant in studio city they are known for a salad dressing that puts women into labor coyote coyote uh it's right by aroma yeah it's right by aroma cafe on Tahunga. and we get there and i walk in and they were like well we know what you're having it's the the salad. It's the the salad, and then in parentheses, it's like yes, that one. Wait, wait, I said I spelled it wrong. C A I O T I. So this picture is really really cute, but I'm gonna copy it just so they can see it. This is the board with all of the baby names since December that have been born after eating the salad. Do you see the number of names on there? No zoom out so they can see my pretty face. And then. Jason is toasting to it, which is very, very cute. And they have, and I thought this was so cute, um, a journal that all of these mamas-to-be, I know, that all these moms-to-be write in. Oh, man, it's going to be funky. And so I wrote my little entry in there, you know, just saying, you know, can't wait to meet her. A lot of these people name their babies. In the stranger's book? In the book. Like, we can't wait to meet baby so-and-so or baby so-and-so. Um, we, of course, did not do that because we don't know which name we're using, nor would we say it before she was born. But it was really cool to read everyone's everyone's thing. So uh, if it happens, we'll let you know, restaurant. Oh, you just turn it off. Jesus is uncontrollably twitching from the tent's back. <laughs> oh, but yeah. What is love? Baby, don't, don't hurt, hurt me. me. Don't, don't hurt me. me. No, no more. more. You gotta move the head going with it. Don't, 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 don't. Episiotomy. What is it? It's when they no. cut. No. We don't want that. No, we don't, we don't want that. It's when they cut you bleh, to give the baby's head more room. Depending on the circumstances surrounding your delivery, doctors might perform an episiotomy to give your baby more room to squeeze out. My doctor and I are on the same page with this. No, 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 no. Unless it's completely medical, medically necessary in the moment. Yes, but she doesn't, doesn't she doesn't believe in them really unless it's totally necessary. Yeah. So that's good. Baby Tibbet, baby Rosenwalk is ready to meet you. Are you ready to meet her? Yeah. You get to meet her. Newborns can recognize familiar sounds that they've heard in the womb. So taking a little extra time to chat with baby Rosenwalk could help you start to meet her a little bit early. Today's tip. If you just can't wait to meet baby, try going for a light walk 
oh, we walked a ton today. It wasn't just a light walk. We, we walked. As exercise is believed to help many naturally induce labor and coax baby on out. My mother-in-law was so funny because she commented on the baby mama video. Like, how did I not go into labor <laughs> after doing the whole drop it down low thing? Um, drop it down, drop it down, down low. That song has been stuck in my head all day. Me too. Uh, good job. Person Berkeley. Thank you. I'm like, who wrote that song? Um, but feeling good. And that, yes, we just had dinner at that place. And we'll see if it uh, kickstarts anything. So subscribe. Subscribe here. Diddy. Watch a Diddy. Anything else? BGR, hurry up. I want to see. I mean, we're still, you know, due date's still two days away. But it would be really nice Anxious if she comes while my dad and Zach are in town. Zach just got yeah. back and dad's here. And it would be nice. If she comes when we're here. Love. Love. Two days. Two days. Oh my goodness. Two. Two days. Uno, dos. Uno, dos. Bye.